Guys, this is my uh, unboxing of the Wen 2307 Rotary Tool Kit. I bought one of these for a real simple reason. Uh, we have a stripped bolt on my wife's motorcycle, and you know we've tried all kinds of different things, and the bolt just won't go. So we are going to, or we were looking online, and we saw someone that said, if you have one of these rotary tools, like a Dremel, you can make yourself like a slot in it so that you can use a flathead screwdriver to take it up. So I, of course, went online, looked at actual Dremels, and they're a little more expensive than I actually wanted to pay for something like this. So Amazon to the rescue, and I came and found this, right? So this again, there it is, right? When Rotary Toolkit 2307. Now they have a whole bunch of different ones. Uh, I actually wanted the 2305 because it came with this cool little extension thing so you could hang the actual uh, this piece up and you know have this flex cable whatever which was about 10 bucks more but they were saying it was gonna be two to three weeks delivery and I didn't want to wait that long. Um, so this is basically your Dremel Chinese uh, knockoff. $23 you know 23 bucks. Like, why can I? Why can I? Why? Why not have one of these? Right? Just there, just in case. So let's see what it is. Um, the box itself has some good weight to it, so that's all right. That gives me uh, an inkling of hope that it's not going to be, you know, complete, a complete disaster. Now it does come, or it says it comes with a whole bunch of, you know, I don't even know what you call them because I don't use this kind of stuff very often. It comes with all the little bits, right? So like the little sanding pieces and grinding pieces. Uh, and supposedly a whole bunch of them. But at $20, including the tool, not overly uh, sold on that. So I'll probably go through those if I use them fairly quickly, as would most, my guess would be. Um, and I'll probably invest in some better ones Hold on, coffee time. Cheers, coffee time. Um, down the road because you know you probably want better ones. So inside the box, a box in a box, right? That's cool, box in a box. So there it is. That's a much nicer box, right? See that? Do you see? Hundred and one piece rotary tool kit, variable speed. Now this is the big one that I like. So I was looking at the actual Dremels. And the Dremel, I could get a fixed speed, so it was just on or off. And I think it, it was one of the cheapest ones I could find. I think it was $60. Uh, 30,000, I think it was 8,000 to 30,000 was the speed. Um, so that's the RPMs. Sorry, there's with 30,000 only. This is 8,000 to 30,000. So they have one too, like their higher end ones, which come in around the $100 mark that are, you know, variable speeds. And those do the same, 8,000 to 3,000. Uh, one year warranty. I'm always a little concerned with that, especially if it came from China because they'll probably charge me $1,000 to ship it. Um, but let's see what it says here. So I'll let you see that side, right? So that side there, you know, Spindle lock, brush cover, speed dial, six foot cord, good. Hanging storage loop, on off switch, and a 120 volt, 60 hertz, one amp motor. Okay, this is what it says comes in the actual rotary tool kit. Variable speed rotary tool, yep, with you so far. Bit changing wrench, yep. Two felt polishing wheels, two high speed cutters, 10 grinding stones, 54 sanding discs, one dress stone, 20 cutoff wheels, four sander bands, one drum sander, two mandrels, two drill bits, and two uh, collets. Don't know what half that stuff is. Uh, I'm actually looking for basically a metal cutter. Uh, is it in here? I have no idea. Um, if not, I can find one at, you know, Home Hardware, Home Depot, Lowe's, something like that, right? <clears throat> okay, so on the front, very nice. It's a nice looking box. Looks like it has some kind of quality to it. Now, I don't think, this was the other one. In the 2305 that I was looking for, it said that it came in a case. Now, my guess is this box is the case. So, um, I'm probably going to just keep that to store this. Unless this is a case in here, which we'll, we'll soon find out. No case. No case. So, there you go. So, you open it up, and this is your box. Right? Right like that. Uh, which, is, which is fine. 
so this is your little box of bits. Again, I'm not going to... Wow. I was going to say I wasn't going to go through these, but I kind of just want to show you this one, if I can open this, without break, breaking it. Oh, there's tape on it. That would be why I can't open it. That's better. Okay. I'm going to bring this real close, real fast. I don't know if you guys can see that. You see that? There's the, uh, what do they say? How many bits? 54 sanding discs. 54. Uh, they are like, I don't know, I guess they're sanding discs. They seem like they'd be sheets of paper, but maybe they give you 54 because you blow through them like wildfire. Um, but everything else, you know, everything else is in there in this little, little dealy. Uh, I'm going to try to tuck that back in there before it all explodes and falls apart. So that has a little case. That's okay. Snaps in there. That's cool. That'll 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 do its job. But again, I think I'm gonna just keep everything in the box more handy. Um, and then you actually get the actual. Alright, so this is this six foot paper six foot power cable, as they said. Good. Everything's really heavy. Like it's got some good solid weight to it. So I, I'm very pleased with that. Um, there's your uh, speed. There's no. There's your on off. Now, someone had asked or seen in the different videos for hanging it that this piece here comes off. You can unscrew this top piece, and they're like, I don't understand why this comes off. And nor did I uh, until I read again the 2305, which has the flex cable on it. So basically, you would pull this piece off, attach the flex cable, and that flex cable then would, would go. Um, for those of us that don't have the flex cable, that includes me at this point in time, and probably me for a long point, long time, um, that piece isn't going to come off. So there it is. So yeah, that's all right. We, uh, we'll give this a try down the road, and when we give it a try, we will make sure to film it uh, to see if it actually does its job. If not... You know, like I said, twenty, twenty-three dollars, I think, for this. So I don't even think I could even rent one for that kind of price. So I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, I'm gonna stick this all back in the box again. Oh yeah, just so you know, it does come with a little, little tiny manual. How exciting is that manual? Probably not very exciting. Uh, it does have a cool little picture of this person. She's all willing to answer my questions, which is super awesome. Um, rules for safe operation, make sure the kids aren't away, aren't there, you know, never stand on the tool, do not overreact, cool, keep proper footing, all right, uh, a lot of safety rules, and list of accessories, getting to know the rotary tool, it's not very big, uh, as far as what I can see as an overview, the English looks good, uh, sometimes you got to be aware uh, this whole thing, though, is in English, so that's handy. That whole thing is... So I was worried that it's going to be like, here's six pages in 17 different languages. Then that wouldn't be a good manual, but it's the whole thing is in English, so that's good. Um, so, guys, please, 20 23 bucks, I think it was. Uh, and again, with Amazon, if you spend over a certain amount, uh, you get free shipping. So I did. I ordered three things, um, and because of that, I got free shipping delivered at, to the house. Very cool, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and we will talk to you again later. Ciao.